Can humans ever explore Pluto? It's very far away. It lies at the edge of our solar system, almost four billion miles away. That's farther than any human has ever traveled. If you sent a light signal to Pluto today, it would take about five and a half hours to get there and another five and a half hours to come back. So a message to Pluto and back, about 11 hours round trip. In 2006, NASA launched a spacecraft called New Horizons to fly past Pluto and study it up close. It took nearly 10 years to reach Pluto, sending back the first detailed pictures of this icy world. Human missions face huge challenges, extreme cold, radiation, and a journey that would last decades. Pluto's surface is frozen solid, covered with nitrogen ice and methane, but its mysterious heart-shaped glacier hints at geological activity beneath the frozen surface, making it a fascinating target for science. For now, though, NASA is focusing on planets and moons that are a bit closer to home. There's plenty to explore in our own cosmic backyard. In the next decade or so, we'll send the first missions to Saturn's largest moon, Titan, which is about as far from Earth as Pluto is. By the 2040s, if all goes well, we could even send the first humans to Mars. But Pluto's icy grip on our imagination won't let go. Someday, with advanced technology, humans might reach Pluto. When that happens, we'll be able to explore its mysterious heart-shaped glacier and learn more about the geology of this distant world. We might even find signs of life, either past or present. Until then, Pluto will remain a frozen mystery, an icy blue dot at the edge of our solar system, waiting for us to unlock its secrets. This is our channel. Do you want to know more about Pluto? Watch this video next.